Thank you for joining me. This is Flyman Mavic. Uh, FlyApp has just been updated to 1.4.12. Messed up the compass, apparently. I'll be taking a look at that in a future video. Uh, this video is about a new edition. It's called live streaming. Now, if you've had the Go and the Go 4 app, then you've always been able to live stream to Facebook, YouTube, and RTMP. Currently, the FlyApp only has RTMP, which means you can only live stream to YouTube. Not Facebook, because Facebook requires an RTMPS connection. I'm not sure the difference is, I think one's probably more secure. So you would have been stuck with YouTube, but thanks to a guy called Simon Lee on the Modding Lounge, he's pointed out this. It's a web page called Restream.io. And basically it takes the stream from your quad and sends it out to Facebook, Twitch, Live, etc, etc, which is really, really good. And it's really simple to set up. You don't need to use a computer. Nope, you can quite simply uh, use your phone. And I've got my Android phone here set up and ready, and I'm going to take you through how to do it. So let's go to the Android phone. Uh, go to Restream.io. Uh, once you've signed up, uh, you need to edit destinations. Now, I've already done mine. I've already got YouTube and I've already got uh, Facebook set up. If you click on Add Destination, there are loads and loads of different things you can actually stream to. I'm not going to do any of those, just the two I've got. Now, you now need to set up the Restream.io with your DJI Fly app. To do that, you need two things. You need your stream URL. If you click on here, let me go back so you know. Stream with OBS vMix. And if you just go to the little cog next to upgrade, you'll get your RTMP URL and your stream key. Now, they need to get copied into the app. Very important, though. Let me just bring up a notepad on my desktop, and I will show you how to make sure you do it correctly. As you can see, you'll have your stream key here, and it has to be separated from your URL by a forward slash. So let me just do that again for you so you know what you do. And you get RTMP, and it'll be Facebook, whatever else. And then what you do is you hit forward slash, and then you type in your stream key, okay? So when you're going to put this into the app, I'll show you how you do it. So let's go back to the Android phone for a second. On the Android phone, you've got this here, RTMP. If you click on copy link for mobile, it says copied. Then go into your DJI Fly app, click the three dots, click uh, onto transmission and live streaming platform and RTMP. Now it says RTMP address. Go in there. Let me just delete that. I had that for testing earlier. You type in there, you go paste like that. So you've now got your RTMP URL. Now you need to add your stream key. But before you do, you need to put in a forward slash to separate the URL from the stream key. Simply go back to stream key here. Tap on reset and that will copy it. And then you copy that into your um, fly app as you did previously. Now, obviously, I am not going to do it because then you will see my stream key, which I don't want you to see. Once you've done that, you basically click on done. And then you can go live by choosing your resolution or your live stream bitrate. So excuse me for one second. Well, I just add in my key and I will show you what happens. Now my stream key is in and you can't see it. I'm going to go with 1080p and 5 megabits and I'm going to click on OK. And what will happen is it will count down and you'll get a little icon just by the battery sign and a little microphone icon. I am now live on Facebook and you can go to your other phone. Let me just switch it over to the desktop. Go to your other phone here. And if you go into the section here for Restream, it should show you as being online. And it's a streaming monitor so you can see you've got a live stream coming out of your quad. Give it a few seconds while it appears. There you go. There's the live stream. This is a live live stream. This is just a preview. And destinations are down here you can see that i am actually on facebook live so let's go over to facebook live and see whether or not it actually is so if we now go down to our live stream here as you can see click on play go into the section here for restream it should show you as being online and it's a streaming monitor so you can see you've got a live stream coming out of your quad so there you go i've now live streamed to facebook it's the same for live streaming to YouTube. You just simply need to put your details in. Now, I always thought that on YouTube, you had to go to the live section and click on stream, but you don't. You can just stream to it. You then use the web-based live stream part of it to actually just upload it and deal with it afterwards, but it does come up live on YouTube. I'm not going to cover YouTube because most people tend to use Facebook Live more than anything else. But if you don't want me to cover YouTube, let me know, and I'll happily do a video on it. But that's it. You can now stream uh, from the Mini 2 uh, to Facebook Live, which I think is really, really good.